Looks like every freaking Cape Coral Police Department member is right across the street from my house. New video at 11. You're watching the moment Cape Coral Police and Homeland Security agents took a suspected child predator off our streets. Investigators say the man in his 50s was trying to lure a child to have sex with him. Thank you for watching NBC2. I'm Peter Bush. And I'm Elise Chingari. Police arrested Stephen Murphy after agents went undercover and caught him sending disturbing messages to who he thought was a 12-year-old boy. NBC2's Madison Adams is live on Southeast 7th Place in the Cape where Murphy was caught speaking with neighbors who are shocked to learn what was happening on their street. The U.S. Department of Homeland Security initially launched this investigation, but Cape Coral Police ended up taking over because Florida penalties for this type of crime are tougher than the federal level. Oh, you need the Lord. There's something wrong with you. That's just demonic. It's evil. Robin Roth is disgusted after hearing that her neighbor is being accused of sending pictures of his naked body to an undercover detective thinking it was a 12 year old boy. I do because when I think about children, I, oh, don't hurt the babies. Don't hurt the babies. The Cape Coral Police Department says 56-year-old Stephen Murphy used a messaging app called Kick to try to send explicit photos and messages to who he thought was a child. The agent let him know that he was a 12-year-old boy and said, hi, I wanted to contact you because you look young. Internet predators that are online who think they can hide behind a screen um, and this stuff can be very damaging to children. After several weeks of collecting evidence yesterday, Cape Coral Police and the Department of Homeland Security got a search warrant and raided Murphy's home on Southeast 7th Place. I hear this siren and I hear rumbling. Next thing I know, there's all these people going in this house over here and there was guns and the shield. I didn't want to think it was something that serious simply because there were you know, children over there and not all the time, like I said, but still just knowing that, you know, that there were kids in that house. Police say they also found opioids in his house, adding that he was trafficking drugs. Based on the evidence that we found, we were really happy to arrest him, get an internet predator, um, you know, away from our local children, even children online elsewhere to protect them. Cape Coral Police have not disclosed if Murphy sent nude photos to any other children. They've only said that he sent them to that undercover detective who was pretending to be a 12 year old boy. If you believe your child has been in contact with Murphy, call Cape Coral Police. I'm live in Cape Coral, Madison Adams, NBC2.